What's up, everybody? And welcome to another week of the number one show on the TV. You know it's all about pre this. Now, pre this, this week we're in Havendale. You don't know my scheme or my place. So, right now, big up to Quenchable Water because here on a general degree, the whole team, a two months in a day with the show, I'm love it. The free water, something that it bad. So, now for the next half hour, you don't know. I'm Cruddy, the whole pre this team there. We have entertainment, fun, lifestyle. Keep it locked. So we kick off the show this week with highlights from the Christmas comedy cook-up. Now, if you missed this one, you missed the best comedians from North America and the Caribbean. Big up to everybody who came out, who laughed till them belly hurt them. Of course, Terrence, the cameraman, the best cameraman in the world right now. Laughed till him side hurt him. If it's Terrence on the ground, I roll. Trust me, we have the highlights. Here we are. Pretty this. Check it out. Rum bar, rum cream, let's say. Some of them, they not blow shot properly and them something. You know, it's a bit distressing. Very rare you find a man who looks like a man's man. You know what I mean? Like you look like you have a penis. You know, I like, I like a man. Like you look like you have a penis, please. Some of them two old them punch with towels at me. I said, no. What do you? Your man has never gone here, bro. What do you? Because sometimes you know you have to look at, you know what I'm saying? You have to try to size up a little, you know? You just have to open it up socks tucked in there, no. Because some of them have the little tricks. You know they have the little tricks. But, you know, you want a man to look like a man. And I'm worried that we're losing that kind of masculinity in Jamaica. I don't know. You know where Jackie Pantaya your man? No, you know what I want to see me a job? You know, you know what I see me. At your office, Mr. CEO, you don't want to see me. Come here, go there, I want to see you, I'm not trying to go up here. Stop with me! From Ninja Man to Busy Signal. From Cheap Party to Tax Party. From BOJ to IMF. From Vegas Gibbon to Vegas Gibbon. Now, a different stuff when you have in a Jamaica. You have driver and police stuff. You have different. Go on, yo! Go on! That's what you do. I'm missing police over there. Stop, man, man. Come out of the car and run. And police are running down out of the car. We must share the bleed. We must share the bleed. We must share the bleed. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here! 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 Come here, come here, come here. Come here
Superb, superb, superb. Everybody that came on delivered. I give thanks. Um, it should actually keep more than once a year. Because comedy has something that bring joy, bring unity. Just straight fun. I'm like having a good time. Who's your favorite comedian tonight and why? Oh gosh, Tricks, the guy from Canada. That guy. You should have bought off your aunt course. Trust me, straight up. Funny as hell. Um, it was fun. Which of the comedians you enjoyed most and why? I attend Fancy Cat. It was wonderful, spectacular. I enjoyed it to the fullest. Who was your favorite comedian and why? Okay, I should say the young miss had come up. She did a very, very, very nice piece. And IT and Fancy Cat, the Bajan, okay. And the, the gentleman that danced. It was great. Yeah. Who was favorite. your favorite? Tricks. Uh, if I'm in Jamaica, which is always after Christmas, so I'm normally, I normally try to make it home for Christmas with my kids, so I always try to come. This is probably like my third or fourth one I've been, so it's a regular, them know me. You have a blast though. Always, always a good time. Some of the comedians I've seen before, a few new ones, but always. I'm a big supporter of IT and Fancy Gatter in any aspect of it. Okay, can we top this one? We're doing the same thing, better and bigger. I thought we would want to do that next year. Take it to a different, to a larger venue and bring a real big name, brand name, American A-lister. We heard that you'll be doing comedy once a month starting January. Talk to us about that. Yes, we're going to go back to the, the, the monthly series um, I, 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 idea. We had backyard for three years every month. And we, we thought that it, it worked to unearth new talent. We want to go back there. We're, we're looking to go to a new 
a new venue, we don't want to name it yet, but an exciting new venue. It's going to be every last Wednesday. We're going to, bring, we're going to have open mic. We're going to have a resident host and bring in overseas acts to, to, to mix, up, mix up things. Now, a few weeks ago, we brought you highlights of Petcom customer appreciation in Ochi. Now, Petcom keeps doing it big, and this time they're in Brayton. Now, here, a whole bunch of people get free gas, free everything, courtesy of Petcom. And you know, Petcom gone green right now, so it's one of the best companies right now. So let's head on over to Brayton right now and check it out. Customer appreciation, Petcom style. Every day is a new taste of life, and Petcom cookie makes it so right. Big, big barbecue or a little cocoa, this Petcom cookie just a sat it out. Dinner for two or a bird night, two is cooking, the nigga just a sat it out. Petcom cookie, the real Jamaican guest right through the day and the night. You can be sure of You're a customer of Petcom, Brayton. How long have you been a customer here? Uh, from 19, like, I was here, 9 to 4. Tell us about the kind of service that you enjoy here at Petcom Brayton. I like the car wash. My youth work and work here. Uh, yeah, we have a banking machine right over there. We don't have to go far. We have the supermarket right there. Well, I normally come here twice a week and purchase special here. And I normally come to the supermarket. Well, I should say the little shopping fair and get stuff here. Nice service from the lovely attendants who you normally come here with and stuff. You normally get good price here, you know, because right now you have to watch every money you spend. So this is a good. No one really mentioned about the other station, them, but you come here and so you get a deal. So we have to go with the deal there. Service stands out at Petcom Britain. We have been operating here for the past 19 years, and this is a community service station. That's why we are catering to the community at this time. It's our customer appreciation day, something that we do yearly, giving back to the community that has given to us. Petcom is closely associated with everything in the community because. When we started, we were the only business in this area. So you know, all the basic schools, the churches, the youth clubs, everything that is going on, Petcom Britain has to be part of it. So we have contributed a lot in those areas. Well, Petcom Britain is a one-of-a-kind station in Jamaica. You get nearly everything under one roof. You have a service station where you can get gas and gas oil. You have a supermarket where you can get from a pin to an anchor. You have a doctor's office where you can go if you are sick upstairs. You have a lounge that you can go and have a drink. A restaurant, a pharmacy, and we have a new addition, a hair store, where if you want to change your hairdo every day, you can come and get it done. No, we do not open 24 hours, but we open as early as 5 a.m. Monday to Friday. And we close at 11 p.m. On Saturdays and Sundays, we open at 6 and close at 11. For Petcom, we are a Jamaican company. And therefore, we find it necessary to always ensure that we give back to our customers year in. So each opportunity that we get across the island, you will find that we will have a customer, a customer appreciation just to say thank you for making us who we are. The whole vibe here today? Well, for one, I can say that the customers must feel appreciation, appreciated. They have been coming in and out for the entire day. The pumps have not been empty so far and it's already almost closing time and they're still coming. This year it's Jamaica 50 and as a Jamaican company we do this as our part of saying thank you. Pre this, it's now time for our first commercial break so keep it locked. Remember you know, pre this cruddy, if we deal with it, keep it locked.